In this video, I would like to show you how I made these two bracelets inspired by Covey Sharma's theater outfits from Wicked with characters Alphaba and Glinda. If this is your first time here, welcome to the channel. If it's not, welcome back. These bracelets are for 18 inch doll size, so for example, American Girl, My Life As, and Our Generation. For these bracelets, we are going to need elastic string. I like to use string that has a size of 0.5 millimeter and 0.019 inch. We will need beads and we will also need scissors to trim the string and later to trim off any excess string and be careful with your scissors because scissors are sharp. I would like to show you how I tie off the bracelets. So I start with this side and I take that over and under and pull that together and then I take this side again do the same exact thing and tie a knot and then what we want is to pull it really tight it's going to feel like you're pulling it too tight and it's gonna break and it certainly could but it really should probably only break if the string is either brittle or dry and what this is going to do is make it so that the bracelet won't pull apart when you put it on your doll for our alphabet bracelet, we are going to need 24 black beads, 24 shiny black beads, 4 green, 4 blue, 4 orange, and 4 yellow. So for the pattern, we're going to start with 3 shiny black beads. One blue. Three black beads, one yellow, three shiny black beads, one orange. Three shiny black beads, or I'm sorry, three three black beads, not the shiny ones. And then green. And then we would just keep going with that until all the beads are strung on. After you've tied off your bracelet string and trimmed off the excess, you will have completed the bracelet inspired by Covey Sharma's Alphaba Theater outfit from Wicked. For our Glinda bracelet, we are going to need 40 clear beads, 10 green, 10 pink, 10 blue, and that is going to add up to 70 beads in total. So for our pattern, we're going to string on one blue, one pink, one green, oops, I was out of frame, <laughs> and four clear, and let's do that again, one blue, one pink, one green, Four clear. There's one, two, three, and there's the fourth one. And let's do that one one more time. Blue, pink, green. Four clear. And then we would just keep going with that pattern until all 70 beads are strung on. After you've tied off your bracelet string and trimmed off the excess, you will have completed the bracelet inspired by Covey Sharma's Glinda Theater Outfit from Wicked. This has been a tutorial on how to create two bracelets inspired by Covey Sharma's Theater Outfits 
from Wicked with characters Elphaba and Glinda. Now that we've completed our bracelets, it's time to put them on our doll. Time for a fashion show! <laughs> Here is the bracelet that we made inspired by Kavi Sharma's theater outfit from Wicked with the character Elphaba. And I'd like to show you what it looks like on our doll. So there's what it looks like. And here is the other bracelet we made inspired by Kavi Sharma's theater outfit from Wicked inspired by Glinda. And here is what that looks like on our doll. So I've got Mar Mary Ellen in kind of like a green tank top for Elphaba. It's not like what she actually would wear in the show, but I thought I would put her in green because she's she's the green girl. And then I've got Kit in um, kind of like what I thought Glenda might wear in the show. Thank you very much for watching and happy bracelet making! Time for a fashion show! Here is the bracelet that we made inspired by 